it's Michelle from CNC Designs. I'm an independent Stampin' Up! demonstrator in New Zealand and welcome to 2020. Happy New Year everybody. I've been having lots of fun these first couple days of the new year um, making things with free items that you can get from the celebration brochure. This one starts on um, January 3rd and goes until March 31st. So anytime you purchase from our current catalogs, which the New Occasions catalog is just about to start as well, uh, you can get free items from the celebration brochure. It's just a way of saying thank you for being customers, welcome to the new year, and it's just a lovely way Stamping Up gives back to um, their customers. And so I've been having lots of fun playing with the free um, stamp set Power of Hope which also comes with an um, embossing folder. So this is a second level free item that you would get um, when you purchase in New Zealand $220 worth of products. Other countries you would have to talk to your um, demonstrator to find out what the level is for that. And I think this is such a fabulous stamp set. I've just been going crazy making things with it. Some of the items that I've made, uh, I've started out with a fairly simple stamping um, card. So this is just using all the images from the stamp set. As you can see, I've used every single stamp on this one. Just white cardstock, uh, red, real red cardstock, and then I've used the um, rectangle uh, stitched frames to um, get the images um, onto the different panels and back them with some basic black cardstock. And it's just a nice, simple, elegant card. Um, I'm not sure if you can see the color there. And then I've left it blank inside so you could use it for any, um, any time um, of the year for whatever you need. Then another one, I made a um, one of those paper lanterns. So this one um, you might be able to see slightly, if I can get a good the embossing folder, so it gives you kind of a um, brick work um, image. <coughs> so for this lantern, after I stamped it onto the petal pink um, cardstock, I then cut it out um, with one of the large um, layering circles and then scrunched it up in my hand to give it some um, texture. And then I just um, folded over uh, concertina-like to give it the look of the lanterns. And this is also another free item. This um, designer series paper you can get free in the celebration. Um, so that's one side of it that goes really well with that, the lovely lipstick. And I just thought that looked very elegant and it reminds me of the paper lanterns. And then just um, a little sentiment on the inside of that one. I'll pop those there so you can see them. Then I went a little bit overboard and made a paper lantern. So this one, if I pull it flat, you can kind of see I have actually stamped on the images on vellum with um, the Memento Black ink. And so you can see all those. And then I went and cut out at one quarter inch, um, or I think it's maybe half a... Um, centimeter uh, slices to do the lantern style so you can push it down and have as much as you want to come out. Um, and then I've just done the petal pink cardstock around the edges and the tassel here is from one of the um, sets. You can get um, the tassels, they come in a set of 18. You can get the petal pink, the whisper white, and I think it might be the peacock um, color and just used a bit of um, thread to hold the tassels so it hangs down. And the flowers are from the Colorful Seasons set in the main catalog. So those are look like, um, remind me of um, the blossoms. And then, let's see if I can get this to work. There you go. Hopefully you can see it. It's lighting up. It's not that dark to see how it lights up but I've got a little um, light on the inside so when you hang it it'll light up like a proper little lantern 
Um, don't ask me where to get the lights. This was a free item that I got um, from the um, Lantern Festival in Auckland a few years ago. Um, we got paper lanterns and then they had those little lights for the inside of them. And that's um, why, how I decided to light that one up. And speaking of lighting things up, here is another card. Again, I'm using most of the stamps um, from the set. I've colored everything in using the Stampin' Blends, so we get the nice little reflection on there. And then on the inside, um, the nice little sentiment, today is a day for new beginnings. But on this one, if you press on the word power, hope is the power that makes all things possible, the lanterns light up. So hopefully you can see that. So that's not lit up, and that is lit up. So I saw this technique online um, using the copper tape and little um, LED lights and was got them and wanted, I ordered them online. So wherever you live, you probably can look them up to order them somewhere. And I thought it was a lovely idea. I was going to try to do something at Christmas, but I ran out of time. And so when I saw this, I just thought, oh, that's perfect. So you get the lit up lanterns. And again, it reminds me of the Lantern Festival, which will be coming up in February here in New Zealand. So I hope you like uh, those little projects there. That's just a little teaser for what's coming up for the first quarter of the new year. If you'd like to um, come to any classes and learn how to do these, uh, please contact me. Uh, if you'd like to order any products and you don't already have a demonstrator and you live in New Zealand, uh, be sure to get in touch and click um, thumbs up for my video as well as subscribe. Uh, I am planning to possibly do a video showing how to make this lantern. I just have to find the time to um, recreate it and come up with some simpler ways to do it because um, being my prototype, I pro did it very, it took me quite a while and so I'll come up with some better ideas as well as the um, light up one. I will try to do a video for that as well. Um, once again, once I uh, find an easier way to show it. Okay, so thank you very much and welcome to the new year. Happy 2020. Bye.